Corel draw tips and tricks. And somebody sent me this clip art as a horse of a horse and they were having trouble tracing it because they were getting jagged edges. And normally when I trace clip, clip art, I just go straight to trace, but I'm going to show them and hopefully you'll learn a little bit. These are both identical horses clip art that I just, they sent me off the internet. So this first one, I'm going to go to trace bitmap outline trace clip art. It, we've I've zoomed in on it. So I need to reduce it. This won't take but just a second. Then when it's through, you're going to press OK. Uh, your trace copy should always be on top. So let's just grab that copy and move it out of the way or move it over. So there's your trace that actually took out the background. But this is the problem they're having with it. It's It's got a million nodes. So in this case, if you ever have this happen, take this is identical. I haven't done anything different to it. Go up, even though it says bitmap, it's actually, I think, a PNG somehow. Go up and go to bitmap and convert to bitmap. Black and white. It's almost like resampling. But now we've got it, and we can go right up here and take. I'm going to left click my no fill because there was a white background. And as you can see, this horse is no white background anymore so we're going to now we're going to trace the clip art i want to do exactly the same outline clip art it's going to ask me to reduce this will actually take less time because i think there's less work for corel to have to do so it might be your advantage but this doesn't always clip arts are all different what i have found and when your computer this will probably go faster my computer is a little slow tonight. Press OK. And your trace copy will be on top. Come on, computer. Now I'm going to put both these horses up close to each other. Look at the difference. The one on the right is where I took out the background before I traced it. But I did convert it to a bitmap. There's the difference. So if you're having trouble when you're getting something like that, try converting it to a bitmap first and actually, you know, take away that background because that horse there will work. It's got good, smooth, clean lines. It would cut out and engrave pretty good. They actually sent me two. I'm going to see what I can do with this one too. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.